Oh, oh where's home? This is home. Well, you say Sydney and then they say, yeah, but where are you really from, like, originally? That's they keep, it, that's <laughs> a, they, keep, they keep sort of digging it, you know, scabbing away, but it's, it's not about that. And I always feel mm. that our kids, mm. you know, whatever culture they're born in, and my son, he's born in Bankston Hospital. Mm. My other one's born in Liverpool Hospital. Mm. Are they going to ask them as well? Because because most likely they'll grow up as practicing Sikh mm. as, as well. So they'll have a beard and a turban mm. yeah, when, when the time comes. Mm. So we have to stop judging people. As Australians, we have to respect every culture and be equal. So we did a hay run out to Canambal in 2015. Yeah. And we put out through 2GB. Yes. To say we're doing this. And one lady rang me. She goes, Amar, uh, I live in East Lakes. As you know, that's a sort of a in eastern suburbs yeah. in the city. I got $50 till my next pension. I said, look, thank you so much for your kindness. Can you transfer it to our bank account? She goes, I'm 80. I don't have any internet. I don't, I, you'll have to come and pick up the dollar for me. For me, that was 50 million. Because if a person can put in their trust in us for the $50, the last bit of their pension for that week, uh, I feel so happy about that that the person decided to donate to us. And that's why we do what we do. It's funded by the people for the people. And most of the time, I think migrant communities and religious communities are accused of being just monotone. It's all about looking after their own. Yeah. Whereas we look after everyone. We, in, in lockdown, we got approached by a local politician who said the local church needed help. So we were delivering 150 uh, hampers to Food. them every week. Food seems to be a common theme with you guys. That's right. I mean, the food is what everyone needs, no matter sure. yeah. what house you live in, where you are. People are going to need to feed their family. Mm-hmm.